Hello, this is Rosana Popetz with Step on Your Fears. How many times have you felt that you wanted to do something creative, but then you said, oh well, it's nothing too important. It's, it's not going to work out for me. What will other people think? They may say I'm, uh, I'm, I, may, I may look foolish. Fear and creativity. Now, I have had this thoughts in my mind for such a long time that I thought that I would be defined by them. Luckily, I found out that we actually need to question everything, especially our own thoughts, because even if they're inside our mind, it doesn't mean that they are true. It doesn't mean that they are real and for sure they do not define us in any way. Now, in order to eliminate this strong fear, this block, this thing that is keeping you from shining, from showing your true personality, from showing who you really are, because you may want to start a business, you may want to write poems or write novels or simply write something that you feel that makes your heart tick in a certain way. Now, this is something major that you need to put in practice <laughs> i'm joking it is this easy to keep your mind under your control and it is following your instinct following your guts as strange as this may seem from an nlp point of view because nlp does teach us how to keep our mind under our control and not be too emotional unless you choose to but this time i want you to try something else since it's about creativity you need to find that thing that specific wonderful amazing activity experience that makes you feel that you give your best that makes you feel the best that you have had um, feeling in a very long time it could either be starting your own business in I don't know sports maybe you are fascinated about football and you want to start a video log about that or maybe you want to have your engineering company your own engineering company or there are so many things that we have a pleasure for. Maybe you are, you have this thing for fashion, for clothes. If you believe that certain people will laugh at you, will consider that you are foolish, or do you think that they will maybe make fun of you, that's when you need to step on your fears and do that thing that you need to do. That thing that makes your heart beat in a different way following your instincts of course it's easier said than done i'm sure that we've all been here what i want to offer you is a very easy tool to put in practice and this is the visualizing exercise that i have created it is part of the step on your fears concept and you'll find it in the seven step guides to permanently conquer your fears i know a lot of guides step fears but go on my website roxanapopet.com and you'll find it there just download this booklet you are going to be amazed how easy and how efficient it is to keep your mind under your control because following your instincts in a world where everyone is out there, everyone is commenting, giving their opinions, expressing themselves, and you may feel that you are not belonging there at all, you need some clarity. You need to know where you're going and this exercise helps you a lot. So go on my website, roxanapopet.com, download the 7 step guides to permanently conquer your fears and enjoy an unblocked mind, a free mind that is ready to take on any challenge that comes along. Let me know in the comments box how is this exercise working for you. I look forward to reading your feedback on this and to knowing that you are well and of course the best version of yourself.